Alright, after that cat. How do I, uh, here we go, it's down here. I need to grab a ticket. Ride the train. Where is she? Rowan and Marcia. Rowan, your conversation was really interesting back there. The science of joy is my favorite of Bradbury's works. <laughs> That's only the merest hint of how many levels a geezer like me operates on. I to expect no less from you. Nor should you, my dear Luger. But still, you mustn't praise me so. It makes my beard itch. You're amazing, Rowan. How can you be so wise and so handsome? And what a stylish dresser, but with an air of mystery. Oh, please, come now. That's quite enough. You're so witty. That's just one more thing we love about you. Does it make you proud of yourselves to pick on a defenseless old man? Hmm. The there she is. She's in the next car. Which means I should probably buy something. I could also probably sell a lot of the garbage I have, but I'm not gonna do it. Although I should sell at least a little bit of that, so I can keep picking up more. After he heard my paraphrasing, he followed up with the exact Bradbury quote. Huh. How perceptive of him. It stopped me dead in my tracks. His eyes were so wise. Yet I couldn't help but notice he had an air of loneliness about him, too. Hmm. Why, Marcia, I don't recall you ever gushing this much about another human. I always knew I could never be enough for you. Oh, rubbish. Don't talk like that. I can't rely on others. People are so selfish. That's why I'm so glad I have you. Nevertheless. Anyhow, I have to... She's talking to the cat. Your outline is just perfect for my next speech. As always, I can't thank you enough for your counsel. Thank you. And good luck. I'm willing to bet. Hmm. The car seems to be empty. Now stab it. So Quick, stab it. Catalyst. Four transforms. Let's get it over with. Come on. I suppose we have to. It's not defenseless. Watch. You people lost or something? It's a talking cat. Now kill it. <laughs> it talks. How is this possible? Wait just a minute. How come you can talk? An ironic question coming from a toy, don't you think? You of all things should know the answer. Huh? Be careful, everyone. What, what did it just do? Ah, now I see. So you've come to kill me. I'm afraid that's not going to happen. It's a big cat. How much health? Not that much. What's it weak to? Light and shadow. I, I can't get up. Can't knock him down. Ow. He's burning us, too. Oh, come on. 
Shit, well, I fucked up because apparently it switched my control to Rowan. What's he doing? Keep, keep attacking. Thank you. I hate that, man. That's my controller fucking up. Where is he? That sucks. I totally did not want that. Oh, well. It's not that bad. What's she casting? Oh, wow. I know she had a move like that. of spreading joy is the greatest joy of all and may all your sorrows be my sorrows Elise truly you are kind of heart Catman nice you better not underestimate Vitaly and mind reversal okay good uh, I see yes so you must be the human gentleman that Marcia spoke of Please, I ask of you, when I'm gone, promise that you'll be there for her. Please do this for me. It's time. Resolves that. He said Elise should know how he could talk. Perhaps the cat experienced some sort of enhanced cognitive capacity. This sort of thing can happen during booster experiments on animals, for example. For real? A booster could do that? Maybe Rolo can talk. I'm more concerned nope. about something else, he said. His last words. Rowan to look after Chancellor Marcia. He was referring to the Marcia of the Fracture Dimension, of course. Still, it is quite possible the Marcia of our dimension is in a similar situation. True. The Prime Dimension and Fractured Dimensions are usually kind of similar. If the Prime Marcia feels the same as her Fracture counterpart, then her dream for the future seems quite similar to ours. That would be great news! Yeah! Perhaps this knowledge will grant us the opportunity to open a dialogue with her. Alright. If we could just make the first connection, I'm sure the rest will go smoothly. If one thing that we old fogies excel at, it's talking. Until Marksburg can fulfill every facet of its purpose as a bridge between the two realms, this old fogey will still have work to do. Alright, Rowan and Marcia, the end. Color variation. Where do I, uh, where do I need to go now? Nowhere in, in uh, Olympias. Still one more place at here that I need to go to. So I have to go to uh, the Aladi Sea Haven and sail south. Sapstraff Sea Haven. What uh what do we have on the board when it loads in? There you go. 21,000 gold. I got my wooden medal. Couldn't try that. That's too tough. I can only do like 24,000 like this thing, maybe. 
This is on the Alahi Trail. Sapstrap Deepwood, Burmia Gorge. Yep. We got a ton of kitty sightings that I need to do. Just to feed five of those things. That's not hard. Life booster. I have no clue. I never found any tanned leather. Oh, I have to just bring it to him. Okay, that's different. money do I have? Oh, I'm almost there. Okay. We'll go out, we'll run out and do this other thing, and then that'll probably be enough to advance the story. Shit, there's a lot of wildlife out here. Actually, hold on. I want to change my battle on my battle team. Get out Jude. Get out Alvin. Where are we going? forward. How tough are the monsters out here? This is Jude's fighting theme. Everything's weak to blades. There you go. Yeah, this is Jude's theme. I remember it. So which way is the right way out of here? Sapstra Deep, uh, Deep Wood. I remember because this was when Mila was injured. Alright, we need to climb up here and leave. The other way leads to Jude's uh, Jude's village. Which I should go to and, and do that. But I'll do that later. Ivy. A wind stick. Which way is the way out of here? Fight this thing. Everything here is weak to slashing. Yep, we're getting there. Almost enough. That's a dead end. A lot of time to make an actual herb, so we don't have any in stock right now. Like, there's a cat here. Moon. Oh, 
thing is pissed off. Is that necessary? Shit, man. I figured as much. Herb again. I'm not even sure we're learning anything. Everything must be so far off. No, oh, I'm swinging past him. Shit. I dashed through him. I mean, I dashed under him. I didn't get. I didn't help at all. Against that, yeah. They're weak to pistols. She did something in the air and then she came down with Grave. That was pretty crazy. There you go. 100,000. What's up, Mushi Mushi? news for you. Former Director Kresnik has stolen the Kanan Waymarker you recovered. What? I've also been given a message for you from a man named Erston. It reads, meet me in front of the Spirius building. The king! Hmm. Let's see what Erston has to say. Very well. We'll continue to pursue former Director Kresnik and keep you updated on our progress. Nice. All right. Before I do that, I want to keep going this way so I can at least teleport later. Where? Come on, you guys! Launch him in the air. Only the AI can follow that shit. I'm looking all over the place for this guy. There you go, back attack. I jumped. Seriously, I always get jump. I never want it. I never want my jump, but I get it anyway. Loot Laker. Interrupted me. Capshraft Deepwood. I couldn't get that. That's weird. How do you get that uh, that elemental ore?
There you go. Again, what is the way out of here? There you go. Kitty. Ah! Ah! I forgot there were the mushrooms that did that shit. Ridiculous experience, though. Hell, it'd be worth grinding here for a little bit. These guys are mad easy. I feel stronger than I used to. Shit, they want you to run right on that. Fertile soil. Wait, what? Oh, light and ground. Yeah, she doesn't learn much. Something I need to have her learn. I forget what it was. 